Think you know markets. Think again. Markets around the world can be fascinating and diverse, but some are downright shocking and unconventional. While most markets showcase familiar products and goods, there are places where the rules are entirely different, and the offerings can be astonishingly bizarre. From human body parts to strange rituals, these markets challenge our perceptions and push the boundaries of what we might consider normal. Let's dive into the world of the 15 weirdest markets globally, where the unusual becomes routine, and the extraordinary is commonplace. The Virgin Bride Market in Bulgaria Number 15, The Virgin Bride Market in Bulgaria In the heart of Bulgaria, amidst the rolling landscapes of Eastern Europe, lies a market that defies modern notions of gender equality and human rights, the Virgin Bride Market in Stara Zagora. This market, steeped in tradition, continues to captivate and shock both locals and outsiders alike. For centuries, this market has been a place where teenage girls, dressed in vibrant, eye-catching outfits, are paraded for potential suitors. These girls, meticulously made up and dressed provocatively, are offered for sale based on their perceived value and their status as virgins. The transaction is not merely a form of arranged marriage but an auction where beauty and purity become commodities. The prices can soar to thousands of dollars, and once a deal is struck, the bride is considered the property of the groom. This practice has ignited fierce debates. Critics argue that it is a stark violation of human rights and a form of human trafficking cloaked in cultural tradition. Proponents, however, view it as an ancient custom that provides a secure future for the girls involved. The market's continued existence forces us to confront the complexities of cultural preservation versus modern ethical standards. Is it a tradition that should be condemned or a practice that deserves to be understood in its cultural context? The Love Market in Sapa, Vietnam Number 14, The Love Market in Sapa, Vietnam Imagine a place where the backdrop is the stunning mountainous landscape of northern Vietnam, and the air is filled with the melodies of traditional flutes and the vibrant colors of ethnic costumes. This is the Love Market in Sapa, a weekly event that combines romance with cultural celebration. Every Saturday night, Sapa Square transforms into a lively, magical space where young men and women from ethnic groups like the Dao, Hmong, and Tay gather. The market is not about buying and selling but rather about meeting potential partners and experiencing the rich cultural heritage of the region. The girls, adorned in traditional attire, and the boys, playing enchanting love songs on their flutes, create an atmosphere of romance and tradition. The love market is more than just a romantic venue, it's a cultural festival that attracts tourists and locals alike. The market showcases traditional dances, music, and customs, providing an immersive experience in the local way of life. For those visiting, it's an opportunity to join in the festivities, enjoy the local cuisine, and perhaps even partake in a traditional dance or song. The Love Market is a celebration of love and culture, wrapped in the enchanting beauty of Sapa's landscape. The Bride Market in Morocco Number 13, The Bride Market in Morocco in the picturesque landscapes of North Africa, amidst the Berber villages and expansive deserts, the Berber Bride Market stands out as a unique cultural practice. Held annually in the village of Amo Mitchell, this market is a vivid example of traditional matrimonial customs. As dawn breaks over the desert, Berber girls, dressed in striking traditional outfits, arrive at the market. Their faces are partially obscured by masks, revealing only their lips and eyes. The boys, equally adorned in traditional attire, browse through the rows of girls, seeking potential partners. The market is a vibrant spectacle where love and attraction are expressed through voices, glances, and subtle gestures. What makes this market particularly interesting is the inclusion of women who have been previously married. These women, with their life experience and maturity, often attract the attention of older men. Once a match is made, a traditional wedding ceremony follows, complete with rituals to ward off evil spirits and ensure a prosperous union. The Berber Bride Market is a celebration of cultural heritage and community bonding, offering a glimpse into the rich traditions of Berber society. The Marriage Market in Shanghai Number 12, The Marriage Market in Shanghai 
In the bustling cityscape of modern Shanghai, a rather unconventional market takes place every weekend in the city's parks. Unlike markets where people are treated as commodities, the Shanghai marriage market is a reflection of parental love and societal expectations. Here, parents set up umbrellas in the park, each one displaying detailed information about their children. The details include height, weight, education, job, and even home and car ownership. It's akin to a job fair but for potential marriage partners. Parents engage in enthusiastic conversations about their children's achievements and character, seeking to find a suitable match. This market highlights a unique aspect of Chinese culture where parents play a significant role in their children's marital prospects. While it may seem like a commodification of love, it's also a testament to the importance placed on familial duty and social expectations. The Shanghai marriage market raises intriguing questions about modern love and arranged marriages, offering a window into the complexities of contemporary Chinese society. The LOM Witchcraft Market in Togo Number 11, The LOM Witchcraft Market in Togo Deep within the dense forests of Togo lies the LOM Witchcraft Market, a place where the mystical and the mundane in. This market is not just a place for commerce but a sacred site for voodoo practitioners seeking items for spiritual rituals. The market is a sensory overload of sights and smells, animal skulls, fossilized bones, dry snake skins, and vibrant bird feathers line the stalls. The air is thick with the combined aromas of incense and animal remains, creating an atmosphere that is both eerie and captivating. These items are believed to hold supernatural powers and are used to create charms and perform rituals that can influence luck, health, and destiny. The LOM Witchcraft Market is not merely a trading post but a cultural and spiritual center where practitioners gather to seek guidance from deities and perform sacred rites. Despite its unsettling nature, the market remains an intriguing destination for those interested in exploring the mystical aspects of different cultures. The Medicine Market in China Number 10, The Medicine Market in China Hidden in the narrow alleys of Guangdong, China, the Qingping Market presents a stark juxtaposition of traditional medicine and the illegal wildlife trade. This market is a controversial and disturbing intersection where endangered species are sold openly as part of traditional Chinese medicine. At Qingping Market, the sight of crocodile heads, rhino horns, and various animal body parts preserved in glass jars is not uncommon. The strong odor of blood and animal remains fills the air, creating a chilling atmosphere. Traditional Chinese medicine often relies on animal parts believed to have medicinal properties, but the excessive demand has led to severe exploitation of endangered species. The Qingping Market is a stark reminder of humanity's impact on wildlife and ecosystems. The illegal trade of animal parts not only threatens the survival of numerous species but also raises ethical concerns about the treatment of animals and the sustainability of traditional practices. The Market for Marriageable Women in India Number 9, The Market for Marriageable Women in India In the bustling city of Imphal, India, lies the unique Imakethal, or, Market of Mothers. This market, established in the 16th century, is a symbol of the strength and resilience of Manipuri women. Originating from a time when men were away for military or labor duties, the market became a place where women took charge of their economic and social roles. Ima Kethel is distinctive because it is entirely run by women. From selecting goods to managing transactions, everything is handled by female vendors. There's even an informal rule that only married women can sell at the market, highlighting the respect and status of mothers in the community. The market offers a variety of goods, from exquisite handicrafts to local delicacies, each stall showcasing the talent and creativity of Manipuri women. Today, despite changing societal roles, Ima Kethel continues to thrive as a cultural landmark and a source of inspiration for women. It stands as a testament to female empowerment and the enduring spirit of the Manipuri people. The Skewen Insect Market in Cambodia Number 8, The Skewen Insect Market in Cambodia For those adventurous enough to explore unusual culinary experiences, the Skewen Insect Market in Cambodia offers a unique taste of local cuisine. 
Located about 70 kilometers from Phnom Penh, this market is renowned for its variety of fried and roasted insects. Walking through the market, visitors are greeted with an array of insects, including shiny black spiders, green grasshoppers, and plump crickets. The air is filled with the distinctive aroma of spices mixed with the scent of crispy fried insects. The most popular delicacy is fried black spiders, which are deep fried to achieve a crunchy exterior and tender, sweet meat inside. Sampling these dishes provides a thrilling and stimulating experience, showcasing the ingenuity and resourcefulness of Cambodian cuisine. The Skewen Insect Market is a testament to the diverse and surprising aspects of global food culture. Each of these markets offers a unique glimpse into different cultures and traditions, showcasing practices that challenge conventional norms and push the boundaries of what we might expect. Whether it's the shocking bride markets of Bulgaria, the romantic love market in Sapa, or the mystical LOM witchcraft market in Togo, these places reveal the incredible diversity of human experience and belief. Exploring these markets not only broadens our understanding of the world but also highlights the complex interplay between tradition, ethics, and modernity.